Rip. What's going on, guys? This is Riggs from Clashing FFS bringing you a brand new video. And I do want to start off by saying GG to Reddit Elefino for getting the victory over FYSB. The final in this random matchup was 113 to 114. So good job to them. But what we're here for, the reason why we are here is we're kind of going to be going back to the future. What I mean by that is this, I'm going to be demonstrating an attack strategy working at every single town hall level. Uh, I do have a little bonus footage towards the end of the war, uh, so definitely stay tuned for that. Uh, but what we're going to be starting off with and what we're going to be highlighting in this video is Town Hall 9. And the attack strategy that we're looking at, it, it's an attack strategy that we saw that was very popular. I wouldn't even say back in the day. Uh, I'll go ahead and pause it real quick. Um, but a lot of people are now building their bases to defend ground. Everyone knows how dominant uh, ground attacks are, specifically hog-based attacks. And with an attack strategy like this one that you see, a CB Lalo, bring uh, one Gom, cold-blooded Lalo, people, when you don't see an attack strategy, for a long time, what ends up happening is people stop building bases to defend uh, older attack strategies. People have kind of moved on with the meta. So what we're gonna be demonstrating in this video is how incredibly powerful this attack strategy is working. And it's not any specific base layouts. As you guys are gonna see, I have four examples using different size kill squads. Uh, having Lalo on the back end and like I said stay tuned for the very end of the video where we have one uh, bonus attack to show you guys I'm gonna go ahead and hit play we're gonna watch Phil C taking on Ninja uh, Yama uh, using CB Lalo as far as the spells in the troop troop comp guys we have uh, one rage one jump that is gonna be for the kill squad we have two poisons and four haste uh, for those of you wondering why there's two poisons is this is a fresh hit the first two attacks i'll be showing you guys are going to be fresh hits the other two town hall nine attacks will be featuring will be cleanups uh but right here again not knowing what was gonna be coming out of the clan castle you'll see it is a baby dragon and a whole bunch of archers and we even have a witch in the back there so it drops down both poisons one to get the baby drag uh, the other one to get rid of the witch and all those pesky skeletons. And you'll see right here, he intentionally uh, or initially wanted to have Queen go in with the kill squad. She ends up even ra uh, wrapping, but uh, bringing bowlers to this attack. No wall breakers, jumping in, raging that kill squad. Uh, the bowlers did go in. He got two uh, of the air defenses down. Uh, the only two remaining ADs are the two over there at 3 o'clock uh, on the far right hand side. And you'll see right here, just dropping down loons. There's no splash over here. You don't always have to start off with your hounds. So it goes in and drops two packs of loons, uh, hasting um, one of them in. And you'll see right here, up at 12 o'clock, he's bringing, again, he brought bowlers in the clan castle. So he brought two of his own hounds. Uh, end up catching the Tesla farm that was behind the town hall. We went ahead and hasted that group in. As the hounds were distracting the two air defenses over here at 3 o'clock, went ahead and dropped in a... a Two more groups of loons, followed up by another haste to haste right there in the core as that expo did get away from him. And just like that, uh, and check this out, even even though Queen didn't go in, um, she ended up still getting quite a bit of value. Uh, notice her health. Because he started the Lalo on the side that the Queen uh, was on, all those defenses got taken out. So he ended up even swagging the Archer Queen ability, uh, clearly dominating on this attack. Uh, with a hound with a hound unpopped and still had quite a few loons left up very very nice attack to phil c showing us how effective cb lalo is right now uh so we're gonna go ahead and jump up one this is also going to be a fresh hit uh by warrior and check this out guys i'm telling you uh this is an attack strategy that we just were not seeing for quite some time again kind of making it back around and like I said in the beginning of the video, a lot of Town Hall 9s are defending uh, ground. 
I mean, at Talon 9, you kind of have to do your best to defend everything. Uh, but no one was really having this attack strategy in the back of their mind when they're building bases. Oh my god, the game is going to be closing for a break. That is absolutely horrible. How am I going to get this video out? That means all the replays are going to be wiped. That is very not good. Hopefully, we can get through this one, guys. Um, rip replays. I cannot believe this. Uh, but two jumps down. Uh, we have Warrior bringing three golems to this attack. Bringing one hound. Uh, you'll see he does have bowlers in the CC. One hound. Uh, we have ten balloons that he will be bringing. He's already taken out one air defense. Uh, golems and wizards over here at 6 o'clock. We'll go ahead and take out the second one. There was a hound in the CC, but because uh, you are bringing a rage for this attack, I cannot believe there's going to be a break. This is so rip. Uh, you'll see right here, golem down. Uh... Went ahead and took out that air defense. You'll see uh, Queen is going to lock on that expo and take that out. And we still have her ability. And check this out. She is going to take out the fourth and final air defense up there at 12 o'clock. That means he's pretty much going to be swagging a hound. Uh, that hound is protecting the loons, what, from the mortar. Uh, but he does still have 10 balloons to deploy. As far as defenses, we do have a mini Tesla farm over there by the BK, an Expo, a Wizard Tower, and an Archer Tower. Uh, hasting these loons in, they're going to go ahead and take out the farm. Uh, they're also going to take out the Wizard Tower. And you can clearly see this is going to be a three-star, a very, very nice attack uh, by Warrior. I don't think I'm even going to be able to show it, but we had another attack by Warrior. End up six-packing this war using this, this uh, exact same attack strategy. Uh, Kill Squad Lalo doing absolute work. That was going to be a three-star. Hopefully, I can get to the bonus footage. That's what I'm hoping I can get to before we get kicked out and all the replays get wiped. This attack right here, like I said, it's not only working at the Tahoe 9 level. Uh, we even have an 11v11 triple from this war using CB Lalo. Gollum down on the bomb tower. God, I hope we can get through this. Uh, where he's going to be sending in both heroes. You can see the clan castle on the very edge of the map. Uh, goes ahead and drops down a poison uh, to slow down all those witches. Uh, and you'll see he's just going to be breaking the defensive ring. Uh, taking out a couple wizard towers. Taking out uh, an archer tower. Well, he will be starting his clone Lalo on the back end of the base. You'll see under ability, he is going to get that wizard tower on the last shot. Starting off uh, with Hounds over at 9 and up at 12. Um, and you'll see Warden behind the loons. Uh, hasting it, dropping on 3 haste. Hasting in all 4 groups uh, with those 3 haste. Still has the clone, a rage, and a haste left to deploy. Uh, that uh, initial group goes right to the core, taking out the Eagle Artillery. And you'll see those other two groups are going to have a nice split under the Grand Warren ability, taking out both the Inferno Towers, clumping up on the ADs. And these two Expos on the back end are actually on uh, ground. Uh, but you'll see right here, uh, it does still have two huge groups of loons left. Minions cleaning up. We're going to go ahead and times this as we do not want to get kicked out of the game right here. Uh, but saving one haste, uh, especially for that wizard tower, a, a fully maxed out wizard tower can completely wreck a group of loons. Uh, and you'll see just like that, getting that 11 v 11 three star FYSB did have, I believe, three 11 v 11 three stars this war. Uh, but hopefully, hopefully you guys found this attack um, useful. Like I said, we start off with the CB Lalo uh, at Town Hall 9. Very, very effective on fresh hits. Uh, and we saw one using stoned. We had another attack featuring stone from warrior. I'm actually going to try to show another one of those. We have not been kicked from the game yet. I want to get this attack out right here. Uh, maybe we'll even times to it. We might even times to it. Hopefully I can talk fast enough to get through it from Mr. Player uh, using. And this was the, the style of bases we were seeing a lot with that dragon attack. Uh, that base that that Tahoe Nines are building their bases to defend. So we got to switch it up using uh, CB Lalo bringing a Max Golem in the CC. We're gonna go times two. Like I said, we don't want to get kicked out. Um, but funneling both sides, heroes down, wall breaking in, no jump spells. Notice he has a rage, a heal, five haste, a poison. Where he's gonna go ahead and slow down uh, the enemy CC, uh, take care of King. 
and queen. Not that king really matters on this attack, but take, taking care of uh, enemy queen, which is absolutely crucial. Hasting in uh, the initial groups of loons over on the upper left-hand side of the base. Uh, dropping down another hound to tank the air defenses, where he's going to go ahead and drop down his rage to get through these ADs. They're going to go ahead and clump up, go from the cannon to the archer tower. Still, Look what's left in the base, guys. Look what's left in the base. We still have three haste and one heal spell. Uh, Mr. Player completely smashing this base, guys. Look at how many loons he has left up. The question is, how many spells is he going to swag? If you answered four, you were absolutely correct. I had to get that attack out to you guys. Uh, look at how effective this uh, kill squad uh, Lalo at Town Hall 9 is right now, swagging a combined four spells on this attack. Hopefully, you guys found this video helpful. Uh, I'm going to get out of here. Uh, we got to get this video uploaded. We got to get out of here before we get kicked just like that. Um, so, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. <laughs> I've never ended a video on a uh, server maintenance, but hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I'm so glad I got to record this before we got kicked. Um, leave it a like, subscribe to the channel if you have not already. Comments, questions, or concerns down in the comment section below. As always, this is Riggs from Clashing FFS, and I'll see you in the very next video.